International supermarket chain Carrefour has been slapped with a 1.1 billion shilling fine for forcing its suppliers to accept lower prices for goods supplied. The Competition Authority of Kenya issued the highest ever fine, saying this was not the first time the Carrefour has been caught in the crosshairs. Here's Jasmine Morani with a report. Carrefour Supermarkets is notorious for unfair treatment and abuse of its suppliers, according to the Competition Authority of Kenya. Uh, this is not the first case, but this morning the matter was uh, as a result of uh, complaints by two suppliers at different times, uh, and therefore uh, we did investigations and requested for information and evidence from the suppliers as well as the uh, retailer uh, to counter check the fact that uh, they have been complained about and if they knew about the suppliers and if they knew that uh, the terms of the contract between the retailer which is carry for in this case and the supplier uh, has been uh, violated as per the competition law. The competition regulator says that time and again, complaints against the giant retailer have been made by suppliers. This time around, it was a complaint by Pwani Oils and a small enterprise dealing in honey that would see a historical fine of 1.1 billion shillings meted on Carrefour. Or in other instances, whenever they complain to Carrefour about their terms and conditions, then they'll be threatened with termination of their contract. And of course that means that they will not have market for, for their produce. And this is one of the major risks that threat or termination of contract is the biggest fear for, for the suppliers. According to the competition authority, Carrefour in its contracts with suppliers requires suppliers to pay listing fees. Woodlands, the small honey supplier, would pay 50,000 shillings every time a new branch is opened. Additionally, upon the opening of new branches, suppliers are required to supply cartons of free goods per stock keeping unit. Further, suppliers are to avail employees to the supermarket at their own cost to take up activities like all-night stock-taking. At the end of the year, Carrefour charges suppliers at least three types of non-negotiable rebates of up to 12%. This, the authority says, explains the large discounts and low prices in the retail giant extended to consumers at the expense of suppliers. The discount that consumers get is not because of Carrefour. It's because of the supplier's profitability. So the gain for consumer is at the expense of not the retailer, but the expense of suppliers. It remains to be seen whether Carrefour will pay the fines and rectify its contractual agreements with suppliers or head to the competition tribunal. Jasmine Murani for KTN News. The acting managing director of the Kenya Broadcasting Corporation, KBC, Samuel Mike.